Rise and grind back at you with another video with the Pull Up King. In this video, we got a 2021 Toyota Camry, and we're gonna be replacing the ABS sensor on it. It's a brand new sensor from the dealer, straight from the dealer. That's the part number there. So, I'll show you what we got going on. All right, so I got my scan tool out. Maximus 4.0 by Matco. So look, this is what we got. Got an ECM uh, trouble code, brake system. All right, so this is what's going on. So we got, she got this right here because it's just an eyesore. All these codes right here just, just keep popping up. So you can see pre-collision system, all of this right here. Start it up, and these lights stay on. All right, so stick around. I'm gonna show you how to clear these lights. Let's get it. We have emotion, man. We have emotion, we have emotion. Yeah, yeah. We have emotion, we have emotion, we have emotion, nigga. And we have emotion, we have emotion, we have emotion, nigga. I swear I'm gonna ride for this, I'm gonna grind for this, I did time for this. I swear I will build for this on guard, my partner got killed for this. Cause we have emotion, we have emotion, we have emotion, nigga. And we have emotion, we have emotion, we have emotion, nigga. I swear I'm gonna grind for this, I did time for this, I'm gonna shine for this. I swear I will build for this on guard, my partner got killed for this. We have emotion, I swear I ain't bragging. All right, we got the wheel off. I'm gonna get behind here, locate the sensor, which is right here. Loving my 10 millimeter bolt. Get that loose, and we gotta come follow it up. Remove all of that. All up through here, it's up, up in here, so we gotta get behind wheel well right, where it's going so this is what I'm using just to pry these clips away all right and this right here I just open that up got that from there I did the same with this bottom one just pushed it out of there 10 mil right here. Now, so I'm assuming you would need to take off this whole uh, shield right here. That guard. So I'm going to try to get back here and show y'all. You're going to have to feel for it. Because it's definitely doable. Alright. That right there. It's on me. Alright, so instead of taking off this whole shield, we're going to go ahead and remove that clip, that harness right there, and then we can pull this on out. Let me get that clip out. It's another clip. Alright, and that's that end right there. So you just press the tab, press that tab in. So everything matching up. Go ahead and install that in reverse order. So what I did realize, it doesn't come off. That bracket, that little piece stays on there. So we gotta take off this bolt here for that brake hose. That's gonna be a 14 mil. We just pull that out like that. Take that off. Back in here. I just put that bolt back in there. All right, now I'm screwing that over. Put that back in there. 
Install the sensor. Last thing, go back up top and install. And we in there, let me show you. Got that clip on there. And we got the sensor attached. Alright, just like that. We in there. Alright, so I started it up. Doesn't look like it reset itself. So I'm gonna go ahead and reset this light. All right, so all the codes are gone. And if it still had a problem, it will just jump right back on. So that's a good sign. Everything's cleared out. Hope the video helped out. Until next time, pull up King.